When you shop, do you look for a discount? Whether buying clothing, jewelry, or cars, people like to buy at an attractive price. Shoppers love to get deals and make sure to look for discounts. Who doesn't like discounts of 5, 10, or even 20%? Did you know that you could also buy an entire portfolio of securities at a discount too? If you look for a discount when you buy most merchandise, why wouldn't you want to do the same when you invest? Hello, my name is David Schachter. I'm a Senior Vice President at Capelli Funds and have specialized for almost 35 years in an often overlooked area of investment, closed-end funds. Closed-end funds or investment companies and investment trusts have been around for a long time, long before more widely recognized mutual funds or exchange-traded funds. But unlike a mutual fund or an ETF, a closed-end fund does not redeem its shares and can trade on a stock exchange, often at a market price below its net asset value. That's right. You can buy an entire professionally managed portfolio of stocks or bonds at a market price below its net asset value. Closed-end funds can trade below their net asset value at discounted market prices 5%, 10 15 to 20% or more. They potentially offer you extraordinary value for your money. And that is what makes closed-end funds so intriguing. Many investors are simply unaware of the values you may find by investing in a closed-end fund. So please, take a minute to learn about this unique investment vehicle and watch the video by one of our portfolio managers. If you have any questions or want a free report on investment companies or to simply learn more, call us at Gabelli Funds at 800 Gabelli. That's 800-422-3554. Thank you. The market price for a closed-ended fund is based on supply and demand, which fluctuates daily based on many factors, such as economic conditions and global events, investor sentiments, and security-specific factors. There's no assurance that a fund will achieve its investment objectives, and you can lose money by investing in a closed-ended fund.